The last part that we have to make is the handle knob. And we can see this is a circular part of two chamfers and a hole cutting through it. So let's make this in two steps. We'll make a revolve for the circular part and then cut the hole. I'm going to start a sketch, as always. Oh. First, I need to make a new part. Oops. Start a sketch and draw that line that's going to be our center line. Now I can draw this shape out, ignoring the chamfers at first. And if we were to take this and just cut it in half, it would literally just be a rectangle. So I can just give it a diameter. And then I can go in and make the chamfers of 0 0.0625. Click my corners. And that's all there is to it. So we revolve it. And now we have a hole that has a diameter of 0.375 inches and a depth of 0.5 inches. So let's use the hole tool. And I'm going to select the end and then select the circle around it to center that. Change my depth to be 0.5 my diameter to be 0.375, and click OK, and there it is. So we can change our material to, again, alloy steel. And let's save it real fast. And then let's check our mass of 0.046 pounds.